Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we will discuss a question which says that Mrs. Hilton has a heater in her room. The following graph shows the temperature in Mrs. Hilton's living room. Examine the graph. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know some results. And the first result is Upward movement of graph shows an increase in quantity along the y-axis and downward movement of graph shows decrease in quantity along the y-axis. Now these results will work out as a key idea for solving out the given question. Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now here we have to examine this graph which shows temperature in Mrs. Hilton's living room. Now if we analyze the graph we see Temperature is on vertical axis and time is on horizontal axis. Now from the key idea we know that upward movement of graph shows an increase and downward movement shows decrease in quantity along y axis. Now here temperature is along y axis. Now initially the room temperature was low and then there is an upward movement of graph which shows an increase in quantity along y-axis. Now here, as temperature is along y-axis, so this upward movement of graph shows increase in temperature. So from A to B, Temperature increases when heater is turned on and now in middle part of graph that is from B to C we see that there are many fluctuations in the room temperature. Sometimes it goes up and sometimes it comes down and then in the later part of the graph, that is from C to D, there is a downward movement of graph, which means there is a decrease in quantity along y-axis. This means in the later part, the temperature starts decreasing. So we see increase, fluctuations and then decrease in room temperature with time. So we can say in this graph initially the temperature was low and when heater was turned on the temperature increased at a steady rate. But after some time, there were fluctuations in room temperature. The temperature went up and down for a certain period and then it started decreasing steadily when the heater was turned off. So, we have examined the given graph and this is the solution of the given question. That's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.